The 2019 Eurovision Song Contest in Tel Aviv is less than three months away. What can we expect in May? We asked the executive supervisor of the Eurovision Song Contest, Mr. Jun Ulasand. First of all, what do Tel Aviv and our previous host city Lisbon have in common? They're both really vibrant cities and close to the sea. They have a sort of a history with the sea and the oceans. Tel Aviv is a much newer city, but they're both very liberal, tolerant, uh, has a really good vibe and a lot of good food uh, and a lot of nice people. So a lot of similarities. It's really a city where you can come as a guest and feel embraced the moment you arrive. Tel Aviv so far has been very good to us, the way they have met us and the way they have approached us with ideas, how they can do it. So we are sure that Tel Aviv will be a great host city for Eurovision Song Contest. What can be expected of the shows? There are not really any new things to expect uh, for Eurovision Song Contest 2019, but we're always tweaking to make sure that it is cutting-edge, top-notch entertainment and that we keep the competition strong. Since 2014, the Green Room has always been situated in the venue. In 2019, that will change. The green room takes up a lot of space in the venue, as we have seen it over the last years. Since we have a smaller venue uh, in Tel Aviv this year, we decided to move the green room to a venue right next door, where we can also sell tickets for an experience in the green room, uh, where you can have a close contact with all the artists. You can have a different experience. We think we will have a more vibrant green room than ever. It will be extremely fun for the artists to be there. The world's biggest international music competition deserves the best international crew. They have established a really good production team here with the best talent in Israel, combined with the best actually European talent. Some of them from other places in Europe that have worked for Eurovision Song Contest many times, so they carry on the knowledge and the experience. But combine that with the best local talent who knows the vibe here in Israel, who knows what Israel would like to present to the rest of Europe, makes it a really good combination and I'm very happy about the team here.